Hey guys, this is Farooq again and in today's video, I actually wanted to show you how you can set up Wallaxy and how you can set it up where all your LinkedIn outreach is being automated, right? So we use Wallaxy as our outreach and automation tool for LinkedIn and you can do it too, right? So this presentation, you know, I'll go over how exactly to set it up and what you need to know and what you can expect. Now, this presentation is part of our previous video that we did where we went through every single thing and the piece where we talked about Wallaxy, I want to use that piece on this video so that you guys can see how you can implement the, the software, the automation part of it. Now, after looking at this video and after implementing this, you would be able to automate all your outreach on LinkedIn, right? So if you have any questions, feel free to reach us out. You can either comment below or, you know, there's a link in the description for setting up a call with us. If you want to talk to me or my team, help you set up the LinkedIn automation and help you set up, you know, other automation for your lead generation you know, we would love to help you and love to talk to you. So with that being said, let's jump on to the presentation and kind of show you how to set up the Wallaxy software so you can automate your LinkedIn. Okay, so let's see how we use Wallaxy in our business. So let me actually take you to our account here and kind of show you how things work. By the way, first thing you need to do is download the Chrome extension. And once you download the Chrome extension, you can pay for the service for the first month. You, I believe you get a seven day free trial. So you can do that. And then once you have the Chrome extension here, it will always be running, right? So once you open the relevant page, it will be able to run the automation. So here, if you talk about the software, we have two important things, right? First thing is the prospects. This is where all your lists live, right? So this is where all your lists are residing. And then we have the campaigns. So the first thing is that we need to go into LinkedIn and create our list or import our list and then run the automation or the campaign on that list, right? So for example, let's say you go into your sales navigator and you go into the leads and you filter out the leads and let's say these are the people that you want. So what you're gonna do is once you're on this page, then you are going to click on the Chrome extension right here. So see, it will automatically detect that. At this point, if you notice, it will only import 2500 at a time because I think LinkedIn tries to restrict us for you know doing 2500. So let's say, for example, here there are 677, right? But if I say there were more than 2500, you can break it down further by going city by city or state by state so that your list is small enough so that it can do its thing, right? So let's say we click on the extension here and uh, we can either push these into an existing list or you can create a new list by cl clicking create here. So once you click on this, you will be able to create a list. And once that happens, it's going to automatically show up in your prospect lists. So let me go back. So ultimately what you do is once you tell them, let's create a new actually sample one, two, three, four, and you create a new list. And then once you confirm, you're going to start importing. Oh, and then you can push the, this list into a new campaign or an existing campaign, right? So you can click here, a new campaign. It's going to create a new campaign here, which there are two campaigns right now. So you can create a new campaign or you can do an, uh, an existing campaign and just select which campaign you want and then it will add these people into the existing campaign right and then once you click on that you can just click on start campaign and then it will automatically start to let me just stop this and it will automatically start importing th the things and importing all the contacts here so this green means that it's actually working right so let me actually show you also how to do a, a campaign from start so that's one way of doing it now this is another way right so you click on create a campaign you're going to pick which templates you want they have a bunch of templates outreach templates so you can pick any one you want but for our purposes we're going to pick uh, two invitation plus a message right then you name your campaign let's say next you name the campaign and then you can either get the name of the people from the list again we have the option there or you can go from linkedin and then once you click on there it will take us to the linkedin tab right you click here it will open linkedin and then you can run the extension and you'll be able to import these right or if you don't want to do that you can click on my list and pick the list that you're trying to get the stuff from right let's say we do pick this list and now it's asking us do you want to add all the prospects from the list? Yes, all the prospects, right? Then it's asking us invitation. 
add a note. Again, you can add a note, but we don't want to add a note. And then we enter a delay. I like to do two days next. And then you type up your offer here or, or your message and then you confirm. And then I say after three days, after you send the first message, then you send another message and then you confirm and then launch my campaign right there. So that's all you do. And the way Walluxy works is that while you guys have your computer on, it's going to be running. So when you turn off your computer, it's going to stop running, right? So this is something that runs in the back end and you can just set it and forget it, right? Once automation stops, that's when you can just literally add new list into the campaign or create a new campaign, right? So it's very simple. Now I know guys, I'm talking very fast, but the whole point is like you can watch the video again and try it for yourself. I, I swear. If you set it up the way I'm telling you, it's going to take you less than one hour to understand the whole thing, how it all works. And once you set it up one time, it's good to go, right? So give it a try, guys. You know, this can easily get you 10, 20, 30 appointments a month for your business service, right? So that's all I have for you guys. And I hope this was valuable. Again, this is a total guide. This is all you need to know. You don't need to know anything different. It's very simple. You just need to implement it, right? And once you implement it, you will be able to get appointments. So highly recommend using it. And please, if you have any questions, any comments, please leave us a message, comment, and don't forget to subscribe, guys, because it does take us a long time to put something like this together and put it on the internet. So one last thing, if you guys want to implement this, um, you know, you can talk to me and my team. I'll put a link to book a call with me. If you do want to book a call with me or my team, you can do so down below and we'll be able to help you with this campaign setup and uh, much more things, right? So with that being said, thank you so much. We'll see you on the next one.